video we are going to discuss about domain testing and general practice followed by the domain testing first of all what is mean by domain testing first of all, domain testing it is one of the method of the white box testing and in domain testing we require minimum number of inputs to get an appropriate output if the input is invalid output will be blocking you can say that it is a software testing technique where minimum number of inputs are used to access the appropriate output of a system to ensure the system does not accept invalid input values and the system is expected to give required outputs blocking to the invalid inputs practice followed by the domain testing actually the domain testing can be divided into sub domains hence we can say that equivalence classes and the test using the values from each sub domain what is mean by it here it can be taking one part and in that part it can be divided into sub parts this is the meaning to it and here we can say that one example for example if a website is a domain has been given for a testing one website is given for testing for us then we will be dividing the website into small portions we can say that the small portions are sub domains or equivalent classes for the easy of testing by dividing the sub sub domains it is easy to test this is domain testing domain might be involving in one input variable or the combination of input variable so domain domain testing is a frequently used testing method for any sites or any websites or any apps or etc and here the general practice which is followed by the domain testing firstly input and input can be classified there might be different type of inputs like some might be alphabets and some might be numericals or anything else then whatever the input we have classified then we have to test each and every cases and we have to test more than one time here first case and second case and third case and fourth case and n number of cases can be tested here then whatever the output we get lastly here that is the output of the input this is a general practice which is followed by the domain testing